So now we're off on a cycling toy. Yeah, smile. Yay. We're in, where are we? Fisherman's Wharf. supposed to depict a change in a millennium. Anyway, you might recognize the front of the building from the movie The Rock with Nicolas Cage and Sean Connery. That's where Sean Connery's character had a conversation with his daughter among the Grecian columns out in the front of the Palace of Fine Arts. So inside the building there's a theater. They have various shows there from time to time. Also, about 12 years ago, the David Letterman show did a whole week worth of shows from the Palace of Fine Arts Theater. So, we're going through this area. This is called the Presidio of San Francisco. This is an old army base that was originally set up by the Spanish in 1776. It was strategically placed here in order to protect the only entrance into the bay from the ocean, the Golden Gate Straits. The uh, Bay Bridge is, one, is uh, eight and a quarter miles long, and it's a double-deck bridge that connects San Francisco with Oakland to the east. The bridge is built in two different halves. The San Francisco half of the bridge is a suspension. Hi guys, so we are by the Golden Gate Bridge. Um, so pretty. And Alcatraz is like way up that way. This is crazy. We've come from rain at home to get into actually where we should. so much fog here is because we have a very cold ocean in Northern California. We have the Alaskan current that comes down from Alaska, keeps our ocean water pretty cold. It never gets above about 51 degrees Fahrenheit. That's about 11 degrees Celsius. Also the interior valleys which start about 20 miles to the east of us. These interior valleys get very hot during the summer months, well up into the 90s and over 100 degrees Fahrenheit. side is the Russian Orthodox Church, the Holy Church in Exile. So San Francisco has always been a melting pot type of city, with people coming here, settling here from all different parts of the world, and one of the main reasons why this area grew very rapidly is because of the gold rush in 1849. Gold was discovered in 1848 in the Sierra Nevada mountains a little town called Loma at Sutter's Mill. By 1849, news went all around the world that there was gold in California. People started coming here from all different parts of the world seeking their fortunes. They would sail around Cape Horn in those old schools.
loose. <laughs> anyway, most of the surfers, while well, they all wear the full wetsuits because the water's so cold. Anyway, even though even on a nice day, you won't see too many people out here trying to swim. Because number one, the water's really cold, and also it's a fairly dangerous beach. Because out here, we don't have a large continental shelf that gradually goes out into the water. Here, the water gets deep very abruptly, so we have very strong riptides and undertows. And they do have warning signs on the sidewalk here that say people swimming and wading here have drowned because of dangerous riptides. They also have rogue waves or sneaker waves where these large waves will come up out of nowhere. And Thank you. 